Okay, kids, I got some good news and I got some bad news. What's the good news, Monty? The good news is we have found a way to turn you both back into your 10-year-old forms. Uh -huh. What's the bad news, Monty? The bad news is it's going to take a little bit. Uh, well, how long is that going to be? Well, let's see. Take the calculations here. Divide by the 5 uh, times 12. I would say about 250 daily segments of 8 minutes to 10 minutes long. Okay, so let's just pluck a couple more eyebrows here. Maybe a little more hairspray there. Oh, more lipstick here. A little eyeshadow there. Um, maybe a few spritz of perfume there. Okay, so how do you feel now? I think I should throw myself in the trash compactor and we start from the very beginning. Hey guys, what are you doing? Ugh, I'm trying my best to do any makeup tips I can to make Rune Roxy feel better about herself. Yeah, and it's completely pointless because no matter how much makeup you put on me, I'm completely hideous now. Don't say that, Rune Roxy. Tell you what, why don't both of you practice on me? I'm sure if you just work on my case together with your makeup skills, you'll come up with some beautiful ideas for yourselves. Oh, I don't know about that, Cassie. I have a strict rule about no makeup on anyone under the age of three. Sorry about that, little girl. Actually, Roxy, that's not a bad idea. Take my lead, sis. Let's start with some beautiful shimmering eyeshadow. Oh, there we go. Oh my goodness, it's making your eyes pop out like shimmery golden stars. Now let's try some lipstick on you. I like this shade here. It's ruby red. Oh my goodness. Your lips are looking like two beautiful roses together. <laughs> so darling. Now let's prep up that hair a little bit. Tangled there. A few brushes here. Oh, let's do a little spray there. Ah. Perfect. Now, what do you think, little Cassie? Wow, I look... I look... the same. That's the whole point, my dear. Because no matter what we do, no matter how much makeup we put on, no matter how we style your hair, you are always going to look this beautiful. No matter what. Thank you, that was really sweet. But honestly, Roxy, I think you need to take your own advice. Thank you, Cassie. I honestly needed that. Okay, let's see here. If we take at least 85 time stones and multiply it by these time-altering herbs, we should be able to come up with a solution at least within a year and a half. Hey, Ruin Monty, what's up? Oh, hey, Chica. I'm just helping out Normal Monty make a solution how to turn little Gregor and Cassie back. Oh, my goodness. You guys are so smart. Well, it's mostly your boyfriend who's doing all the real work. I mean, I'm literally only half the man he is. Oh, come on. Don't say that. Why? I mean, it's true. I mean, it's wonderful being in this pizza plex that doesn't smell like it's rotting to the core. But it really doesn't help when I'm the one rotting to the core myself. I mean, I can't perform on stage anymore. I can't walk. I can't sing. I can't dance. I can't do any of the stuff that I used to. Monty, let me ask you, where did the music and the talent come from? Did it come from your legs, or did it come from your heart? Oh, no, you got a point there. Come on, Monty, don't be so down on yourself. Let's find a way to turn this horrible challenge into a wonderful opportunity. Just think about it. We can go get you a wheelchair and customize it just for you. We can make it gator green. We can have little fireworks coming out of it. I mean, just picture this, Monty. You got the rest of the band out there tuning up. You got Freddie warming up his vocals. You got me strumming up my guitar. You got Roxy over there doing whatever she does with her keyboard. And then, out of the blue, you come racing out. Fireworks are blazing on your new wheelchair. The crowd goes wild. They're chanting, Monty, Monty. Can you picture it, Monty? Actually, yeah, I can, Chica. Thank you. 
See, things aren't so bad. Please try to keep up the hope there, little guy. Anyway, I gotta get going. It was nice talking to you. Tell Monty I said hi and I'll see him later. And what are you doing? Oh, just talking to your wonderful girlfriend. Yeah, and don't you forget it. My wonderful girlfriend. Hey, Cassie, do you like cartoons? Oh my goodness, yes, I love cartoons. Awesome. What's some of your favorite cartoons? Mm, that's a tough question, Freddy. There's so many amazing ones to choose, but if I had to pick one, it would be Adventure Time. Oh, Adventure Time is an excellent choice. I love the adventurous spirit of that show. What are some of your other favorites? Well, I also enjoy Steven Universe for its deep, meaningful storytelling. Oh, that's a fantastic pick. Steven Universe has some incredible character development. What else do you like there, Cassie? Definitely, Freddy. I'm also a big fan of Gravity Falls for its intriguing mystery storylines. Oh, Gravity Falls. That's a classic. It's filled with supernatural adventure and wonder. <laughs> List some more for me, Cassie. And let's not forget the masterpiece that's Avatar The Last Airbender. Oh my goodness, it's a masterclass in world building. Absolutely. Avatar The Last Airbender. It's such an amazing story of balance and growth. Hmm. Any others for me? I also like Rick and Morty for its clever humor and out there jokes that happen from time to time. Oh, Rick and Morty is a little bit too much for me. But it's definitely a very unique show. It makes me question a lot of things about life and existence and all the other stuff in the universe. Oh, and one more show I like is The Amazing World of Gumball. It's so wacky and tacky. I absolutely love it. The Amazing World of Gumball is an awesome choice. <laughs> it never fails to make me laugh. Well, thank you so much for sharing all your favorite cartoons with me. We'll have to watch them all sometime. That would be amazing, Freddy. But you know what's the one thing I really would want? A show that's online that stars two baby kids hanging out with their animatronics that's uploaded daily on the internet. Oh yeah, imagine that. An online cartoon show that was uploaded daily. Can you imagine that, kids? Look at the cute little baby. Night, night, little bean. <laughs> Gregory, what's wrong? Why are you crying? <laughs> oh, I know why you're crying. It's because the majority of the people who are watching this video aren't subscribed. So please, hit that subscribe button if you're still watching. And don't forget to like and share this video. Also, if you have an idea for any skits, please leave it in the comments section. Thanks again for watching, Bear Cubs.